Hey guys, Jeff Howard here at Kiteboarding.com and we've always got the questions of how do you change out on the pivots or the Nash, pretty much all of their kites with the sliders. You've got a slider line that you can buy. Here's the extra one. And then you've got the pigtail with the slider. You can see that. And it also comes with the two red stopper balls. So the stopper balls usually don't wear out if they cracked and you have to replace those. But then you also have the slider line. So let me show you how this system actually works and you can replace it. So on the Nash system, you will come down here to the very far end of the bridle connections and they're larks headed onto the knots at the end. This is the location where you're gonna disconnect. So you'll come in there, you're gonna disconnect. Those are just uh, uh, larks heads onto the knots. Once you get those two lines, always remember the longer or uh, which ones go to where. You can mark it if you want. You can put a little mark on there, like a permanent marker, and just say, I'm gonna put the, the, you know, the dot wherever I put it, where it's connected to. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna undo those two lines, then you're gonna loosen them up, and they're loop to loop onto that line. Once you get that off, then you're gonna slide down to where the stopper ball on one of those sliders. These are just basically limiters that keep the slider from going any further on that slider line. Once you get to the slider line, then again, you're gonna undo the loop again, loop to loop. Once that loop is undone, then you're gonna slide that stopper off and then your slider easily comes off the end of that line. Once you get that off of there, you change that out, you slide your new one on or your new pigtail then what you're gonna do is get a small piece of line. It doesn't have, it can be way shorter than this. You're gonna connect it onto that loop and then you're gonna pop that right back through that stopper ball. And you'll see a larger section of that stopper ball goes to the outside because that locks onto that knot right there, that loop to loop, and that stays right there so the slider cannot go any further. So again, daisy chain everything back out. Put that line back onto that one lock it down the stopper then come down here stick your other two lines loop to loop back on to that line and then spread those out and larks head those back on behind the knots securely and then you're set that's how you want to change out your slider you can change out that whole line if you want to but you ladder lot or ladder connect all the way back to those systems so if you need to change that out do so your slider or your pigtail that's how you do it. It's a really simple system. It's not difficult, but you'll just see how you lock, uh, ladder lock those back out. Anyway, that's Jeff Howard here at Coppity.com. Get the parts, get the pieces, keep you flying.